Well, not every story is a good one. Uh, but I'm here to tell you one. I'm here to tell you a story. Uh, it's a beginner's journey, and so even the most beginner things need to be told in order to share information. And uh, so basically, I'm going to make this one quick. This past weekend, went out into the woods to the summer house. They're called Mökki here in Finland. So summer house for the rest of us English speakers. And it's uh, kind of like dark skies over there. Portal 4. I live in Portal 8 slash nine so you can imagine portal four is pretty nice anyway uh i went to take my very first astrophotography photo so i was only going to use the uh the nikon d7200 and my stc astro duo narrowband clip-in filter uh bought from cyclops optics and i spent about 20 minutes trying to fiddle this guy in gently into the camera body before going back to the computer and just looking on their website just to triple confirm or however many it was that this filter indeed fits into this camera body for some reason i couldn't get the metal clips that that hold it into place to fit into the camera body no matter what i tried uh and of course i'm trying to be super careful it's very expensive glass this is with all the shipping and import costs, it was about 300 euros. And yeah, I was just really trying to get it in there, but without force. And uh, and so I, I checked the website. It definitely says that it's supposed to fit. And so I felt a little bit more confident saying, okay, this must fit into this camera body. It must fit. So I uh, I really tried to get it in there and it got jammed underneath the shutter uh i don't know what the piece is called that, that comes down it got jammed under there and i had to kind of pry it out of there and when it came loose the glass broke my heart was broken devastated it was supposed to be my first foray into astrophotography and i broke the filter now uh i wrote to cyclops optics who then copied in STC and they are sending me a new one for the cost of shipping. That is amazing customer support. And I really want to uh, give a shout out to STC for treating their customers so well. The replacement is going to have some cosmetic damage, I guess, to the metal that holds the filter in place, which is more than fair considering I broke this filter trying to get it into my camera. They they didn't have to do anything for me. And, and they're still going to send me a working version. They said that there's nothing wrong with the imaging part of it. And I'm so excited and so happy that they treat their customers so well. So highly recommend STC. TC for their customer support. Uh, they also said that they're going to uh, invite me to a video chat when I receive the new one so that they can actually show me how to put the clip filter into the camera body uh, with a one-on-one -on -one session. That's awesome. Uh, they also sent me a video. Now with the video, it's like less than a minute of showing how to take this filter and put it into the camera body. I watched it multiple times. Uh, I figured I've already got a broken one. Let me just try. What's the worst that can happen? I break it more. So uh, of course, being careful with the camera, I tried to get this broken filter in there following the instructions on the video. It doesn't work. It doesn't go into the camera body. I'm not sure if there's some they they reassured me there's no defect. I mean, who would want to admit that there's a defect, but uh, maybe the defect is with me. <laughs> I'm defective in trying to get this clip-in filter into the camera body. Uh, but I'm very interested to see now what the replacement looks like and to see if there's these two metal pieces that come down that hold it into place. I want to see if they're actually in the same position. Uh, I have since mutilated this this filter, just really trying to get it into the camera. I have not got this thing even with tools to get into the camera even one time i can't make it work so uh it's me doing a very poor job of doing something that should be quite easy or there's a problem with this thing but we're gonna see when i get the new one but either way so happy with their support really uh after a devastating weekend really made me feel good uh about picking them as a brand to invest my money 
in gear. They take care of their people. So keep that in mind when you're considering different options for your filters. And that's the story of how I uh, was able to burn 300 euros in a matter of minutes by breaking the STC do uh, Astro Duo narrow band clip in filter trying to get it into my Nikon. Hopefully you don't have the same problem, but that's my story. That's why this is a beginner's journey. So until next time with better news. See ya.